The new manager of South Korea's men's football team, Jurgen Klinsmann, says he's targeting Asian Cup glory and wants to bring a positive energy and confidence to his team. Our Choi Soo-young tells us more on his first conference in Korea since taking over. South Korea's new head coach, Jurgen Klinsmann, on Thursday spoke to the nation's media for the first time since taking over the Taegeuk Warriors. He was appointed on Monday last week and arrived at Incheon Airport at 5 a.m. on Wednesday. At the Thursday's press conference, Klinsmann officially announced who will be joining his backroom staff. Andreas Herzog, who has been working with Klinsmann since 2011, is his number two, while former Tagic warrior and German born Chaduri is a technical advisor. Michael Kim, who was part of Paolo Bento's staff, joins as a coach as two Italian Paolo Stringara, while Andreas Kupke is goalkeeper coach and Wagner Luthard is fitness coach. Following questions about the specific tactics he will use, Klinsmann said that he respects Paolo Bento's ideas, the former manager, and he plans to communicate closely with players. He added that technical ability, body language, communication and confidence will be the most key parts of his team. Moreover, as a legendary striker, he said that he will lead the team by attacking. My personal background was a striker, so I always love to attack. <laughs> According to the Korea Football Association, Klinsmann has signed for a period of three years and five months until after the 2026 FIFA World Cup in North America and will reside in Korea during that time. He also mentioned that his coaching staff will move freely in and out of Korea, but they will always be with the players wherever and whenever they'll need it. He said that he knows how to bring a confident energy and strong belief to a team. And has set a short-term blueprint to win the AFC Asian Cup in Qatar next January. Choi Soo-hyung, Arirang News.